It is a rivalry game in the Royal Purple Las Vegas Bowl on Saturday, December 19th, as the BYU Cougars play the Utah Utes. These teams used to play every season, but with BYU and Independent and Utah now in the Pac-12, they have not met since 2012. The Utah Utes have dominated this series recently, winning eight of the last ten, including the last four. This game will have an extra meaning for the BYU Cougars, as it will be the last game for head coach Bruno Mendenhall, who is leaving to coach Virginia. The BYU Cougars had a really good season, with their only bad game coming in a blowout loss to Michigan. BYU survived an early season injury to their starting quarterback and thrived under backup Tanner Mangum. The Cougars scored about 34 points per game this season while allowing just over 21 points per contest. BYU went over the total six times and under the total six times in their 12 games. The story in this game will be that Bruno Mendenhall will be coaching his last game for BYU. He accepted the head coaching job at Virginia, but he demanded to be allowed to coach BYU in the bowl game. The Utah Utes are not happy with going to the Las Vegas Bowl, as they were hoping for a lot more this season. They have only themselves to blame as they drop two of their last three games. The Utes scored 30 points per game this season, while allowing 21 points per contest. You almost have to throw out all of their offensive numbers for the season, though, as most of those numbers came with running back Devontae Booker, who is now out due to injury. Taking a look at the numbers, the Utes have been an excellent bowl team under head coach Kyle Hennigam, as they are 8-1. The Cougars are 1-5 against the spread in the last eight meetings in this series, and the Cougars are 5-2 against the spread in their last seven games in December. The Utah Utes come in at 6-2 against the spread in their last eight games in December. Taking a look at the over-under, the under is 4-1 in the Cougars' last five neutral site games, and the under is 4-1 in the Utes' last five non-conference games. For our pick and prediction on this game and every other game this week, check out the Bang the Book Betting Center. And don't forget that the Bang the Book Betting Center is your best resource for sports betting information before you make your weekly assault on the sports books.